how to manifest, which is establishing intention, beginning to see visually the kind of life you want to uh, live, beginning to have conversation about that kind of life. I tell people you have to talk about it more than you talk about your problems, because at the end of the day, if you're complaining more than you're talking about your vision, yeah. then you're in inertia. So this is a shift that takes place where you're actually talking about the possibilities mm -hmm. more than you're talking about your issues. Yeah. You don't deny the issues. Bad things have happened to people. You're not denying that those things have happened. But it's the energy that you give to it. That yes. is a definite true fact. If you start talking about somebody or you're engaged in a conversation where you're gossiping, before long, you're just, you're, 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 spir you're spiraling down. The energy goes into those lower frequencies. Yep. Doubt, worry, fear, all, and now you're in, you're in that sediment. Mm -hmm. You're in that dynamic. Mm -hmm. But if you start talking about possibility, even, even if you don't know how to get there, then your energy starts to go up. Mm -hmm. You know, what if you ask a what if question? You know, what if, what if all my needs were met? What would I be doing in my life? What if everything is really working together for my good? What if all the bad things that have happened in my life are leading me to activating some great potential in my, in my experience? Mm -hmm. What if God really is on my side? Yeah. You know, you ask a what if question and you start to notice little tiny miracles happening in your life. Mm -hmm. Things start to manifest. You don't know how they got there.